Hey, what's up, guys? How you doing? Uh, it's the Gravity Rush 2 demo. Uh, it's not a full version, it's just a demo. I just wanted to try it out to see how it looks on my uh, Samsung KS8000 to see if it's worth it or not. Um, I'm going to show you my uh, calibrations. But first, let's go through the game a little bit. Let's see how well uh, it looks. I was excited to imagine what new adventures await me in the city. And then there was darkness. Deep black darkness. Let's do a beginner course. Um. It looks pretty good actually. Um. This is the uh, upscaled version. I don't know if this is running on uh, 1080p. I'm guessing it's 1080p source. When I say source, I'm talking about the direct source, the native source from the game. I'm guessing it's 1080p. I haven't checked with Digital Foundry, so I don't know. I'm guessing it's 1080p upscaled to 4K. It looks very nice. You, we've been struck working the mines for the Bonga settlement. Uh, I wonder what kind of things are waiting for us in Jigaparalaho. Could be tribal out there waiting for us. Nah, I'm not gonna do this. Forget it. Oh, I see something over there. The graphics looks really nice, and the game really pops. You know. This is what happens when you have that uh, 1000 peak brightness nits and that quantum dot color. This is where you truly benefit. All right, so I don't even know what I'm doing here, man. You know, I never played Gravity Rush, so I'm kind of like, I'm kind of new to this. And the. The controllers are kind of strange. You know what? Let me show you really quick. Let me show show you my TV settings. Obviously, I'm using a game mode as always. Game mode. Um, backlit. I don't know if I really want to have a backlit at 20 here because uh, this is not a HDR game. So maybe I can do something here. Hold on. How about this? Keep it at 15. Brightness of 40. Contrast. Let's keep it at uh, 95. Sharpness. Mm, 26 is okay. Color. I left it at 63. Uh, let's see what else we got. Smart LEDs, we can turn that off. There we go. Um, dynamic contrast, we can turn that off as well. But I feel here it's fine. Here we can use it. Color tone, it's standard, which is fine by me. And the gamma. Let me see something, what I can do with the gamma here. Let me try to move the gamma down to minus two. Let's see. Let me go to control settings. Hold on a second. Let me go to uh, control layout. Oh, I, you cannot change it right now. Let's do a camera configuration. No, I don't want the inverted. How do you turn that off? Keep it normal. Normal. Okay. Now it's going to look better. Alright, that's better, man. The camera was inverted. That's why I was like, what the hell?
The response time, it's okay. You know, it's not the best. There is a little bit of lag. I noticed a little bit of lag, but not that much. Let me let me try and turn off everything. Hold on. Let me uh, let's go to expert settings and let me go ahead and uh, let's put it normal. No, not normal. Hold on. Keep it at automatic. Black levels. Dynamic contrast. It's high. That's fine. Standard gamma. Let's bring gamma at zero. I don't know, man. I'm just really. I'm not really impressed with um, the way this game is looking. Um, It could have definitely used HDR. Why didn't they use HDR on this game? I just don't understand. Especially a game like this would definitely pop in HDR, so I don't understand why they refused to use HDR on it, but hey, that's okay. I mean, it looks good, but it's nothing uh, uh, mind-boggling, you know. It's nothing that's gonna make you go like, oh, Jesus, you know. Okay, so I'm floating. Cool. Oh, that's cool, man. Gravity rush. Alright, so the video is going to end pretty soon. Uh, I'm going to do a part two. This is part one. I want to explore some more on this game. I'm gonna mess around with the uh, TV settings a little bit more just to see what I can get. Uh, I mean, it looks nice, but it's, you know, come on, Sony, man. Why won't you put HDR on this game? This game definitely would pop on HDR. I mean, I don't get it, especially when you have PlayStation 4 Pro. Patch, patch this game up with HDR, man. Come on. All right, so I'm gonna uh, go ahead with part two. We're gonna go ahead and uh, do some more calibrations.